I have some unfortunate news. Al Sadana is no longer with us. Funeral services will be held at the village altar. Please come if you can. Let's go! Also, hey everyone, Surreal Canine here. We're playing La Milana 2. In the last episode, we found a crystal skull in the Eternal Prison, but we didn't really make much progress into the uh, into the main riddle. Let's go to the village altar. All the tents are closed. Oh, hey guys. At least he was able to see the ceiling of Lama Lana through and fulfill his dream of living here above ground. We haven't met with Giltorio. Giltorio, the philosopher of wisdom. He's been searching the world for items and life forms that may have invaded the outside world. Sometime after sealing off the ruins, we philosophers of the Seventh Children decide to live here above ground. Since then, the Locopala and Eglana have stolen several relics. It seems they are specifically targeting one of the relics your dad found. The crystallization of the Mother's Power, the secret treasure of life. I'll give you this. It was used in a treasure seal known as the Mulana Jewel. Mulana Talisman acquired. You can use it to break curses on important treasures. Take it with you. Alright. The Philosopher's Departure. Achievement get. Mulberg? She looks pretty upset. Now that Samaranta is over uh, over there, can I get past here? Looks that way. What is here? Sacred Orb. Okay. Sad. Well, I guess we should uh, get back to Valhalla. 
still haven't uh, quite figured out. New message. What? I received this tablet object from Samaranta. I have something I need to tell you. Could you please come to our temple? Alright. Uh, that is in Anfu. Slightly differently shaped stone tablets you saw in each area are akin to commemorative monuments telling the story of the world of Eglana. There are also records left by our race, records of the final secret in the plan to seal off Eglana. Now that secret is to be released. I have attached a sigil to the secret words inside the tablets. I apologize for the inconvenience, but I am not able to speak the blasphemous words aloud. Please read the plan tablets once again. My race planned the sealing of Eglana. To do this, we would have to awaken Eglana once more. After many long years of contemplation, we realized the Sky People's plan for sealing Eglana was a viable option. That this plan was woven around you, an eighth child, must be fate. Your people will live on in the new era. It is up to you to seal off Eglana, lest the entire world be destroyed. In order to seal off Eglana, Lamulana had to be sealed off simultaneously. However, no one could have predicted that the mother would transfer her mind itself, the ninth child, her final offspring, into Eglana. This has brought chaos and confusion to the races remaining in Eglana. The blind obedience to our mother that is woven into our very being makes it impossible for us to seal off Eglana. I'll see you again. Do you have anything else to say? Do you remember the trickster of Yggdrasil? We, Alfred, created him from the corpse of one of the giants known as the Jotun that we found in the Shrine of the Frost Giants. We inserted him into the war between the Aesir and Vanir for the purpose of spreading chaos and discord within Eglana. His very existence was part of the plan to seal off Eglana. I see. Alright, so, we need to read each of the tablets again. This one was in... Jormungan's room. So, I guess we're putting the Eternal Prison on hold for a little while. <laughs> Mulbrook, are you back? I live together with the Philosophers in Lulana. The seventh children remaining in the ruins. Alcidana was like my grandpa. I loved that guy. He lived such a long life. Yeah. Is that all she had to say? Alright. I am too high up. I need to go down. Night. Okay. Part two is at the roots of Yggdrasil. Uh, not here, it's below us. Missing. Three is at the Fairy Watchtower. Oh. <laughs> All right. Underworld is no longer on hold.
two. Yeah. Mamma mia. this unless there's a pedestal somewhere that I'm missing oops oops Well, I'm dead. Absolutely brilliant, Mr. Guy. Well, the thing is, we haven't seen a cursed chest yet, have we? So why are we getting this now? to be Oh, I can break this. Uh why would I though? Understand any of this.
Ragefield face warped with murderous intent is part of the prophecy, but... Why is this here? Unless I'm supposed to... Not like that. No? No. What am I doing wrong? Do I need the cup of Soma? But how do I get it without a zillion mantras I don't have? I don't know what this guy is doing here. No light. The room. I need the proof of judgment to enter the duot room. But I haven't found a place where Osiris could possibly be yet. I don't even know where Anubis is. Or where to find Garm. Oi. Yeah. Well, at least I made it through the bottom without dying, but... I still feel like I don't know what I need to know.
sure wish I had some idea what I was doing. But I don't, so maybe it's time to gather more clues and uh, get it a rest. See the, uh, the village is back to normal. Used for breaking curses on important treasures. We should talk to Giltorio. Maybe. Breaking into museums to steal things. For generations, the Builder Elders kept the jewel safe until the eighth children were able to take it. <laughs> hmm. The mother's power that kept the inside of the runes brightly lit and provide the power necessary for various traps and mechanisms to work. Okay. <laughs> hmm. I see. And now you're repeating yourself. Is there anything still on the going on at the altar? Oops. Doesn't seem that way. I think we are done for now. Thank you all for watching, guys.